previously talked about um, the, the help that Ada has given with the uh, light rail going through. Um, can you talk, maybe uh, talk about what impact that has had on you uh, and your other business that's just located right down the street from the bakery? Um, and maybe about uh, some of the impact it had on other, other businesses around you too. Um, the light rail it was a little devastating to a lot of businesses because University Avenue's parking for the business was mainly street parking. And so the light rail took over a lot of those spots. And like, luckily for us, we had a parking lot behind the building. And so it wasn't super devastating for us, but for a lot of buildings, they didn't have any parking besides the street parking. And so that was really difficult. And so I think a lot of businesses ended up leaving for that specific reason. Um, Ada did come through and try to help with a lot of like possible shared parking lots and things like that. But I don't know how successful they were with a lot of businesses because it's hard. I mean, in the summertime it's fine to walk, but in the wintertime, you know, even half a block can be difficult. Um, so we were lucky that we had parking, otherwise I'm not quite sure what we would have done. We might have exited as well. Um, but yeah, that's. I think the biggest thing was parking. Second was during construction, it's really hard to get around. And if you don't know your way around and then you're not specialized in what you do, then people might go elsewhere. Because I feel like we opened the bakery at the right time because of the light rail's done. Had we opened before and struggled through that, I don't know if we would have survived. For the salon, it's specialized. You know, people are used to going to a certain person. And I try my best to make it worth your wait or the trouble to come see me, so you're happy. Um, but if it were me with food, maybe I could eat somewhere else, you know? Um, and so I think that's the biggest struggle with a lot of businesses is the parking and during construction, just getting there. So what are some of your aspirations for the future for the bakery? Um, just to be a neighborhood staple. People want to come here, um, to be known throughout the Twin Cities as a place to come, um, make the light rail, you know, something that you want to use, a destination on the light rail. Uh, you know, be successful like any other business. 